milk. The first step begins at the local dairy farms. Here they raise the calves from birth where the owner of the farm personally names each one, like a new member of the family. On the farm, they believe that happy and healthy cows produce high quality milk. And quality milk is the first step in a high quality protein supplement. Each day, the fresh dairy is transported directly to one of the local cheese manufacturers. Here it's separated into curds and whey. The curds, or solids, go on to be made into cheese and the liquid that's left over is your whey. This liquid whey is immediately loaded on a truck and taken a short distance down the road to the protein manufacturing facility. Here, the whey first goes through pasteurization and then on to filtration. It requires filtering and refining over 720 pounds of this raw liquid whey to get just one five pound container of finished whey protein powder. Now this starts by sending the liquid through a massive web of stainless steel tubing that are fitted with specialized ceramic filters like the one you see here. This natural cold temperature process separates the protein from the fats and the lactose, resulting in a finished product that's extremely high in protein while retaining the important micronutrients. Now this differs from other methods such as ion exchange that uses harsh chemicals that can reduce these important micronutrients as well as denature the protein. The last step in the process is pumping the liquid into a dryer where it's mixed with both hot and cold air to separate the liquid from the solids. At the end is a 90% whey isolate protein powder. From here it is quality checked for protein content before being bagged in its raw form ready to go over to the next step of the process where it will be blended into the finished protein product you see on shelves. First, all of the individual ingredients are weighed and measured. And this is the point where our mouth-watering gourmet flavors like chocolate brownie are added in. Next, everything goes through a giant high-speed paddle blender to ensure complete uniformity. Giant bags are filled at the bottom and taken over to the last step, which is bottling. As the bottles come down the line, they are first sanitized before being filled, weighed, and then quality checked to make sure that every single bottle has what the label states. From here, it gets a BPI label, sealed for freshness, loaded in cases, and then stacked on pallets for delivery. Whoa, not so fast though. Before our proteins ever leave the factory, bottles are selected at random and tested in the lab to make sure that the protein content is exactly what it's supposed to be. They are then compared to a control sample for consistency in flavor, color, and 